In this module, we will talk about the negative of a number and multiplicative inverse. Let us first introduce negative of a number. While studying integers, you have come across negatives of integers. What is the negative of 1? It is minus 1 because 1 plus minus 1 is equal to minus 1 plus 1 is equal to 0. So what will be the negative of minus 1? It will be 1. Also, 2 plus minus 2 is equal to minus 2 plus 2 is equal to 0. So we say 2 is the negative or additive inverse of minus 2 and vice versa. In general, for an integer a, we have a plus minus a is equal to minus a plus a is equal to 0. So a is the negative of minus a and minus a is the negative of a. For the rational number 2 by 3, we have 2 by 3 plus minus 2 by 3 is equal to 2 plus minus 2 by 3 is equal to 0. Also, minus 2 by 3 plus 2 by 3 is equal to 0. So, negative of 2 by 3 is minus 2 by 3 and negative of minus 2 by 3 is 2 by 3. In general, for a rational number a upon b, we have a by b plus minus a by b is equal to minus a by b plus a by b is equal to 0. We say that minus a by b is the additive inverse of a by b and a by b is additive inverse of minus a by b. Now we can find the negative of a number. Now let us see what is reciprocal. By which rational number would you multiply 8 by 21 to get the product as 1? Obviously, by 21 by 8. Since 8 by 21 into 21 by 8 is equal to 1. Similarly, minus 5 by 7 must be multiplied by 7 by minus 5 so as to get the product as 1. We say that 21 by 8 is the reciprocal of 8 by 21 and 7 by minus 5 is the reciprocal of minus 5 by 7. Can you tell what the reciprocal of 0 is? Is there a rational number which when multiplied by 0 gives 1? No. Thus 0 has no reciprocal. We say that a rational number C by D is called the reciprocal or multiplicative inverse of another rational number A by B if A by B into C by D is equal to 